Hey everyone, how's it going? So we actually have our first look at the mid-season premiere. I guess we kind of had that with the general trailer, but we actually have a photo from the mid-season premiere. TV Line posted an article. It's the first look into the mid-season premiere, and I guess the first look on Michonne's final arc. We actually see Michonne at the naval base, and so I want to talk about the photo and talk about some of the information that we got, because there's some conflicting information here, but if anything, it's probably a good thing because it means we're going to get more Michonne. So yeah, I want to talk about all of that. So before we jump in, Obviously, I do have to warn you for spoilers for the first half of season 10, and that's practically it. And also, if you're new to the channel, make sure to be a subscriber if you want more Walking Dead content like this. This is actually the last video of 2020, or 2020, 2019. We're going into 2020, but this is the first of, I guess, loads of information coming out about the second half of the season. I do breakdowns of all the stuff that comes out, reviews and breakdowns of all the teasers and trailers that we do get. I'm actually kind of surprised that we got this this early. Usually, we get a lot of stuff in January. I guess it's basically January at this point very soon we're going to be able to say that the walking dead returns next month and it's going to fly by it really will fly by december felt long because of the holidays and stuff like that but once it's january like actually what am i talking about it's winter winter always takes forever to end anyways let's talk about this photo here this photo features michonne and virgil i'll leave a link down below if you actually want to check out the full article because they actually go into a lot more stuff here talking about what the photo might mean and stuff like that I'll, like i said I'll, I'll leave a link down below if you want to check it out i just want to give my opinion here and here we see Michonne and Virgil in the back. It seems like they're on a ship. I know it's hard to get that impression just based off this photo, but based off of the lighting, I think that's coming from the sky, obviously. <laughs> but it's definitely daytime lighting, and just the door seems a little tilted. I'm not sure what that is in the background, but we also saw some images in the teaser trailer for the second half of the season. Or I guess it wasn't images, but shots of Michonne on a boat, and she's not wearing that, I guess, poncho or jacket. I can't remember exactly what she was wearing, but she's not wearing that yet. I imagine she's going to get that in here or something like that. This might be from the very beginning. Like, they're on that boat, they get somewhere, and, or maybe this is the naval base, but this is the very beginning of it. This is when they first arrive, and Michonne is just discovering stuff. The look on Virgil's face doesn't give me the impression that this is a trap for Michonne, because just looking at this, you would think, okay, Michonne's in a very scary situation, maybe she's being set up for a trap. But no, looking at Virgil, it seems like he's a little scared to actually go in here. And Michonne's like, I'm just going to do it because obviously Michonne's awesome. And so Virgil's just staying in the back and he's just kind of watching. And because he's not the first one in, I'm also wondering if this is probably not the naval base and just a ship or something before they get there. Just because Virgil doesn't seem that comfortable. And you would imagine if he is from that naval base that he was, he would just be way more comfortable, right? So that's kind of my reaction to it for the most part. I think this is going to be on a boat. It could just be at this random building but they were on a boat already. I imagine they let, they went somewhere else. Maybe they ended up on a shore and there's this other giant boat. They're going to go there. They're, or they're at least scouting that area out to find some supplies. And then eventually we get to the naval base. Or again, this could just be the naval base. What is a little weird, though, is that in the article, it says that this is from the midseason premiere. Like to quote, but at last, TV Line has obtained an exclusive image from the AMC drama's midseason premiere, Sunday, February 23rd at 9 or 8 central that sheds a little bit of light, quite literally, on what might be the formidable heroine's exit story. So, uh, is this from the mid-season premiere? I'm guessing it has to be. Like, if they're saying that, it would... Yeah, I don't know. What the hell's going on? Because originally, about a month ago, maybe a little bit over a month ago, I think it was probably sometime after the mid-season finale aired, which was, I think it's November 23rd or 24th, we learned that Michonne was only going to be in one episode, which I just thought was really weird because of all the shots in that trailer of Michonne in different areas. I even talked about that in the video, like how would they put all of that in one episode? But according to TV Line and just, be, I mean, they got this image, I, I am going to believe them with this, I trust them with this. This seems to be from the mid-season premiere, and so it seems like we're going to see a little bit more Michonne than, we're, than we were expecting, which I am really, really happy about because at this point, it doesn't really feel like Michonne's exit is, is really happening. She's still kind of around. Yeah, we got a little shot of her going on that boat with Virgil, but besides that, it feels like she's still very much a part of the show. It doesn't really feel like she's leaving yet, and... I think we need a little bit more setup to it than what we got in the mid-season finale. You know what I mean? We need a little bit more time to, I guess, breathe with this idea. Because with Rick, we had a... I mean, we knew he was going to leave at some point, but they teased what was going to happen to him in episode four. Like, we saw a lot of that stuff. We knew his last episode of episode five. AMC hasn't actually even confirmed anything with, with Michonne. Like, the rumor is that episode 12 was the last one. Maybe it's not. Maybe it's episode 10 or 11 or something, you know? 
Maybe they changed it up. I have no idea. And like I said, with Rick, we had that set up. He got stabbed by that rebar or fell on the rebar or whatever. We had the whole week processing. Is he going to survive? And we were already at that point. Like we had some setup with Michonne. Like, like yeah, she went on that boat, but that doesn't really mean that she's going to like die or that she's going into a trap or it doesn't really mean anything. And so we need that. And getting one episode of just her and rushing through all of this stuff, I just, I wasn't going to be happy with that. And so I'm, I'm happy that we're getting a little bit more than that. She might only be in episode nine and then in episode 12, which would suck. But I mean, hey, it's better than one episode, right? So I think there's a pretty good chance here that she's in more than just one, just because, I mean, somebody has to be wrong here, obviously. Some people are saying she's just in 12. Some other people are saying she's in, in the mid-season premiere. And yeah, I don't know. The more Michonne, the better. I think it makes a lot of sense because when you look at that trailer there are a lot of shots in there of her on that boat wearing that poncho jacket thing it's like a dark green or brown like jacket like she's wearing something totally different there we still have that shot of michonne holding lucille we still have to see that and when does that come into play like how are they going to rush all of that in one episode we see some flashbacks to her wearing that that hood with the chains remember she always carried those two walkers around there are some shots of her literally in the woods attacking walkers like she's rushing back to Alexandria or something like she seems to be in a panic. Why would they rush all of that in episode 12? I just it makes no sense. And so getting a little bit beforehand with this naval base stuff. Yeah, I like it. I really do like it. I think they can do a lot there. Have the reveal maybe in episode nine that Rick is alive or Michonne finds out and it's like, whoa. And then 10 and 11 deal with some whisperer stuff. Have that battle at the hilltop and then 12. Michonne finally makes it back to Alexandria within that area. She's going through all these hallucinations. She's having flashbacks to certain things. And then, yeah, that's her final episode. I, I still, I really, I can't even imagine what her final scene is going to be like. I mean, can you actually imagine that Michonne's final scene on The Walking Dead? Is she just going to be in a helicopter taking off? Is she going to go on a boat? For some reason, I feel like she's going to be on a boat and leaving just because that happens in the comic. I feel like they can kind of use that here. It's a little nod to the comic, but it's also something original since she is going after Rick. At least I'm assuming she's going to be going after Rick because she can't die, right? I mean, could Michonne die? Could she actually die? I, I, I just, I don't see it. Like, actually think about it. Is there a way that they can actually kill her off? Sure. Yeah. Obviously you can kill off any other character, but like, I'm just thinking here, you kill off Michonne, she'll never be able to find out that Rick's alive. And it's just as simple as that. Like, that's why kind of why you can't do it. It's just so sad. And then whenever Rick does come back at some point, he's going to find out that Michonne's gone, which fine, you can do it there. Like, th like from that angle, Rick finding out that Michonne's dead, that'd be heartbreaking. But Rick has went through that with Lori and stuff. You can do something there. But just from the Michonne point of view, that's where you can't do it. Like, you can't have it where Michonne just never finds out that Rick's alive or that he never died. Cause that's just way too tragic. And so I think Michonne's going to find out more info about Rick in the mid-season premiere. At least I'm expecting it now. Definitely before episode 12. And 9, 10, 11, around there, I think. Because something is going to trigger her to leave that naval base. Obviously, according to those the, that trailer, she leaves that place pretty quickly. And so something is going to trigger her there. Is she actually going to get the weapons? I'm not sure, because when you look at those certain shots in that trailer, she's just alone in the woods killing zombies. I don't see any weapons. Maybe she dropped them off at Oceanside and then she just ran to Alexandria to go tell Judith or I have no idea. The weapons part I find very weird. Like we'll see where that goes. But yeah, as of now, we're getting more Michonne and this is our first look. I'm super excited. Awesome way to end up the new year. But overall, I'm super happy with this image. I'm happy that we're actually seeing this part of the story instead of, I don't know, just some random battle shot or some random walker. Because yeah, I mean, sometimes they're cool, but. It doesn't give us a peek into the season, really. The fact that we're actually seeing this over everything else, I mean, that's super awesome. So expect a lot more stuff like this to come out over the next month. I mean, if we're getting this right now, for sure, within the next two weeks, we'll get a, a, a couple more things, I'm sure. Because two weeks from now is like January 13th, 14th. At that point, we'll be a month away, roughly. The holidays are almost over now, so Walking Dead's coming back. There's a lot of stuff happening in 2020. We have The Walking Dead coming back in a little over a month. The third Walking Dead show is going to be coming out right after season 10 is over. So we're going to have, as soon as The Walking Dead comes back February 23rd, we're going to have a ton of stuff to talk about for, I mean, however long. That show's going to have 10 episodes, right? So if, the, if season 10 ends in April, this show picks up right there. That should go into, I mean, I guess end of May, I guess probably early June. And then would Fear pick up at that point? I have no idea. Not that I'm going to be reviewing Fear or anything like that. <laughs> Maybe I'll do a reaction video to what happens with, with Morgan, because I'm still wondering about that. I, I know he's going to survive, but I am kind of wondering what's going to happen there. I might just do a video for that. Not a review of the episode, just a reaction to what happened and talk about that. But that's not happening for like, what, six months or something? So 
Yeah, and then at that point, we have Comic-Con. There's, I'm sure there'll be some Rick Grimes stuff, some teasers, and then Season 11 comes back in the fall. I mean, 2020 is going to be nonstop Walking Dead. Like, we're going to have something to talk about each and every week. Unlike 2019, it was just, I mean, I guess it was a regular Walking Dead year. Just 2020 is going to be bananas. But let me know what you guys all think. What was your reaction to the photo? Do you have any predictions for what's going to happen? And are you happy that we're going to see more Michonne? Post your thoughts down below. Hope you all enjoyed the video, and thanks for watching. Um, where am I? Here we go.